Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how you can edit your PDF files on Google Classroom using an Android phone. I am using a Galaxy S5, which is an old phone, I know, but I'm, you know, luckily I had it and I wanted to show my students how to do this, so let's get started. So I'm going to go and click on my math class because that's what I teach and it's my favorite subject, and right away I see the announcement page, okay? I'm going to go ahead and click on classwork on the very bottom and boom, here are my assignments. So I already turned in one on how to edit PDF files on Google Classroom, my previous video uh, on how to uh, um, edit PDF files on Google Classroom is up on YouTube as well. I'll go ahead and link it up above. Now I'm going to go ahead and do how to edit on an Android phone. So I'm going to click on that assignment. Here are the directions. Watch this video on how to edit on an Android phone. Now on the very bottom it says your work. Add a private comment and assign. Right on top of that, you see an upside down V. Go ahead and click it, and it's going to take you to your work. As you can see, it says a PDF, and then it says Mrs. Awesome Android Eating, oh, sorry, Android Editing <laughs> Google Class.pdf. So go ahead and click on that, and it's going to take you to your assignment. Boom. You do not need to print your assignment or anything like that, okay? Because this tool is amazing. You have uh, your name, Mrs. Awesome, and then you're going to have a pencil. So click on that pencil. This is going to allow you to write and stuff. So if you look at the very bottom of your phone, you have a square with an arrow, you have an erase tool, a pencil, a marker, a highlighter, and a text. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to use the, um, the select tool. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and zoom in. So to zoom in, you just put your fingers on your screen and zoom in to where you where you want to go. So let's look at number one. So on number one, I'm going to click on the pencil and I'm going to hold it and it's going to re and then release it. So when I release it, you can see all the options. I have all these beautiful colors. I'm going to choose pink and I'm going to put high. Okay. I can also change the thickness of the pencil. So I'm going to make it a little bit thicker and I'm going to put a smiley face. Okay. The next one is the marker tool. So the marker tool, same thing, hold and let go. Click the arrow to pick your color, and I'm going to pick this uh, color right here and make a line. Boom. If I need to highlight anything, I'm going to click on this tool. Same thing applies. Hold and let go. Click on the arrow to pick a color. I'm going to pick green, and I'm going to highlight this triangle right here. Okay. You can also change the thickness of the highlighter to whatever way you want it to be. Okay. Now, if I want to add a text, I'm going to go ahead and click on that text button and I'm going to go to where it says your name and I'm going to type in Miss Dot Awesome. Okay. Make sure you capitalize the M and make sure you capitalize the A. All right. And then I'm going to click here. Now I'm going to put the select tool. And so the select tool is the square with the thing. I can make it small and I can move it around by holding my finger on it, okay? Once I'm done, I click on that again. I can click anywhere. I can zoom back out and you're done. That's how you use those editing tools. Oh, if you want to erase, you click on the eraser tool. You can either clear the whole page where it says clear canvas, okay? Says, will you clear all these drawings? Yes, clear it. See how it's, everything's there? But let's suppose I want to redo that. So on the very top where it says Mrs. Awesome, where your name is, uh, you're going to click the redo, uh, uh, undo um, arrow, and boom, there it is. Now, how to submit. So to submit, you're going to go to the very top right-hand corner where the three dots are at. Okay? Now what you're going to do is you're going to click Save. So it's automatically saving all of your work, okay? Now notice how it says Miss Awesome Android Editing Google Class.pdf, okay? It's going to say now edited. See, it no longer says the other version. It says edited Miss Awesome Android whatever, whatever. So if I, when I click on it, it's going to show me my work. See that? So I'm going to go ahead and put the back arrow, and I'm going to put turn in. It says you have one attachment to be submitted. Yes, I want to turn it in. And you're done, guys. This is as easy as it's going to get. Super fun. 
you know, you use math every day. So yeah. All right, guys. So if you have any questions, let me know on the comment section down below. And I will see you in my next tutorial. Bye.